Hello everybody, I am Moldude, and welcome to Night in the Woods. In the last episode, we begun my favorite game ever, as you know, if you didn't hear last time. This is my favorite game ever, and I'm going to be continuing it today, because I want to get you guys the ending. And I want to uh, just show you this amazing game that needs more love overall. So I'm going to start the game now. No more coffee. Okay, and we wake up and do our daily run around the town. Wow, it's been literally 36 hours since I've been online. This shall not stand. Uh, no, what is wrong with you? Dang it, I bet Angus knows how to fix this. He's all computery, I think. But I can't let him see this. Where does he work again? Okay, let's get out of that before anyone uh, anyone uh, checks up on what is going on. <laughs> okay, this thing goes off randomly every month or so. A little wooden duck pops out, making the weirdest sound. Scares Dad out to death every time. Used to joke it was Granddad getting it, getting even with him from beyond the grave. That's uh, kind of messed up. <laughs> hey, hon. Yeah? Come say hi. Hello, mother. It is me. Morning, mom. Nope, I'm mom 24 hours a day. Har, har, har. <laughs> also, it's 4 p.m., sweetie. Well, I'm off to find Angus. Oh, is he your little friend's Greg's boyfriend? Big guy, kind of quiet. Yeah, that's him. I need him to fix my laptop. Well, he better, sweetie. You can't afford to buy a new one. Wait, do you even know Angus? Do you? Mom, we're in a band together, sorta. Oh, is the band back together? Yeah, we practiced last night. I don't think we're ever gonna play out, though. Hmm. Well, that sounds like fun, honey. Yeah, I guess. You don't sound too happy about it. Eh. Well, I'm off to find Angus. Have a good time, daughter. Thanks for your four hour mom, seven days a week. The conversations with her mother could be random sometimes, but <laughs> I got a call from your Aunt Molly. Ugh, oh, what did Aunt Mollcop want? Sweetie, I really wish you wouldn't call her that. She worked very hard to get where she is, and it's a dangerous job. Oh yeah, Possum Springs is so dangerous. It will be near the end of the game, but no spoilers. <laughs> anyway, did she tell you about the severed arm we found? She did, in fact. Scary things. Yeah, I guess. Honey, I know this is home, but please be careful out there. I will, Mom. And come home before dark unless you're with somebody. At least until they figure out what happened. Okay. Thanks, sweetie. Is that all? Or... So, honey. Yeah? What did the arm look like? It was cut off, like, right above the elbow. Was there blood and stuff? Little bit, little bit. I wonder whose arm it is. Well, it should be pretty easy to spot. Yeah. <laughs> hey, what happened to your arm? I dropped it by the din diner. Here, sir, I found your arm. Thanks, I was afraid I'd never see it again. People don't always return arms when they find them. It's a real shame. It's a cold world. A cold, cold world, sweetie. Okay, that's all you need to talk to your mother this day. Let's see if we could do anything. Oh, it's this guy. Uh, this guy's a grumpy old boomer who always gets mad at you. Even at the end of the game. Hey, you kid! Adult. So you're back, eh? Yes, Mr. Penderson. Didn't last long, eh? No, Mr. Penderson. You got a job yet? Um, yes, I've been elected mayor. <laughs> Hmm, couldn't do worse than the current one. And I've ordered your house to be bulldozed. What, finishing the job you started? I hope you enjoy living in the woods. Those eggs took the paint off the vinyl sidings. Scavenge food, commune with the beasts, Mr. Penderson. Watch yourself, little miss. Little effing miss? No one's forgotten who you are and what you did, you know. They may act like they have, but that's just small town polite right there. Is that what this is? 
small tap lights all you got kid so watch it well that was really interesting but I need to go listen to my cells die pa pa I'm gonna be jumping around these electrical wires like you don't even know. So there's no need right now. Let's talk to Selmers. What's it like being back? Well, I just got home, so just like taking it all in. Feel like anything's changed? <laughs> yeah, totally. Park store's gone. Got a snack falcon now. Food donkey's gone. Got a hand panther though. The Harleys are bigger now. Saw them running around before. Yeah, I babysit those little craps sometimes. Are they bad? They seem so nice. That's how they fool ya. You know they steal things? What? They steal things. Holy crap, I was fooled. Like, she won't give me a poem. She normally gives you poems. I don't remember if she told us one last time. But, uh, she normally tells us, This is my property. But it's my street. You ain't changed since you was a kid. Okay, buddy. Okay. I think that might be the house. I'll check. I'm gonna go check uh, on the electrical wire if that is a house where you could get rats and feed them pretzels. <laughs> that is not a joke, that is a mechanic in the game. You seal pretzels for a bunch of rat babies. Am I spoiling too much? <laughs> Put it down in the comments if you think I'm spoiling a bit too much. It said I could look at something, but then it didn't give me the option anymore. Ghosts. Okay, let's go see if yeah, okay, the fisherman's here so we can talk we could listen to his very exhilarating stories. Pale light cuttlefish. Easy to catch, it's so delish. That's good. Oh god, you were listening. That's like he doesn't have any more lines, that's literally it. <laughs> he doesn't say that all the time, but Sometimes delicious pretzels. Okay, still can't take those. Oh, hello, May. Um, do I know you? I don't know if you remember me, Miss Rosa. Hmm. I knew your grandfather. I visited you the day after you were born. You are so small. I guess some things don't change, eh? How did you know Granddad? I'm here most days. Why don't you stop by sometime? And I'll tell you all about him. Things you might not know. All right, you've got my interest. Sweet, curious child. Last time I played, I don't actually remember if I saw her more than once, though. I've seen her before, definitely. But I don't think I saw her ever again. So I don't know if that's like... I don't know. If, if she actually doesn't mean that she'll be there most days, but... um, I don't remember seeing her. <laughs> I'll go uh, back up through this direction so I can see if there's anything else to do. This is where um, the, the the main characters have their band practice. So, if anyone cares, <laughs> one thing I think this game does really well is it lures you in to what seems like an innocent little adventure. And then it's not innocent at all. Okay. Can I help you? I don't think so. So right now, uh, Angus isn't here. I just wanted to show you guys this. Just in case anyone tries gets this game and tries to look for Angus on the second day in the video outpost too. And he's not there because you have to talk to Greg first. Just saying. Okay, let's listen to their smelters. Better take shelter. Here come the smelters. No use hiding. Smelters will find you. Yeah, that's it. Okay. 
Um, very interesting. I don't think I can go out by the by the side right now, but if you go back here, uh, you could normally talk to Germ. But I've got the first few nights you have to do as the game implies, which is do. You have to go find Angus, so you have to go talk to Greg, or you know. I forgot about this. <laughs> a snack to school. Hey man, got cups on my ears. Wow, or why? I'm gonna say why because this is funny. I was thinking about how they they have beaches in Bright Harbor, and then I was thinking about the ocean, and then I put cups on my ears, and it sounds like the ocean. Wow, dude, you took me on a journey. Speaking of uh, nothing, I guess. Do you know where I could find Angus? At work, at the video store. What do you want Angus for? Got computer problems, figured he might know a thing or two. He's a hacker. Really? I'm pretty sure he hacks. Whoa. Cool, dude. I'll catch you later. Definitely. I'm so glad you're back. So that arm, huh? Jeez, yeah, what the hell? What do you think happened? I don't know. How does an arm end up on the sidewalk? In Possum Springs. I mean, kind of cool, but creepy. And like two doors down from our apartment. You live in Towny Century now? Yeah, we live next door. Haha, <laughs> man, you have been away for a long time. I have. You up for hanging out later? So much to catch up on. Nah, no, I got dinner with the family. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? A friendly thing. Is it six o'clock yet? Okay, no, that's all he says. Greg is funny. That's why I'm doing his playthrough first. And then I'm most likely going to do the B ending. Which is it's the same ending. I just want to specify that first. Because I don't I want anyone to think like it's an, a good ending or a bad ending thing. It doesn't matter. Can I help you? Where's Angus? Oh, he works day shift? Is it? It is day. I got here early? Wait, why does everything you sound like? What? Why does everything say? What am I saying right now? Anyway, you get the point. You do the same thing? I just didn't comment on it? Really? Yeah? Huh? Night shift, huh? That's cool. I'm at home with my baby during the day until my mom gets back from work. Ew, babies. Pretty cool job though. Get to watch movies, eat candy, meet cute guys. Ew, cute guys. What's wrong with guys? I don't know. Cute guys are overrated. Actually, this is a pretty cool thing. Uh, once you do like everything here, you talk with her. Uh, there's like a section in the game where uh, you have to. What's it called? You have you have to go to a party with with your friends, and <laughs> and you actually mention that person that we just talked to and how they said and how we talked about cute guys. So <laughs> yeah, that's that's pretty pretty cool as well. It actually shows up when you talk to someone, like later on in the game. It's not just oh you talk to an NPC you're never gonna hear about them again. Also, I don't know where I'm wandering. <laughs> I played this game multiple times. How do I not remember where to go? This is embarrassing. Here it is. Okay, here's a little mini game. You have to get everything. You have to talk with everyone. And then you've got to, as you can see, it's got no button. So you have to press all of them, and then rapidly press all of them, and then Greg and Angus is one. And then you could talk with Angus, but this is not Angus. Hello, hello? Hello? You're not Angus. Who is this? Who are you? Neighborowski. What are you selling? Do you get a lot of people selling you stuff? Hello? Click. What? There's no button? Hmm, there's gotta be some way to make this work. Like, yes. Uh, hi, Angus. Angus, you say? Dude, it's me. T 
Tell me about yourself, Maybelline. This is Nagus. Would you like it to be? Nope, but look. Look. Maurice. May. Angus? Mary? Yeah. You're not Angus. I do hate Maurice. Well, I'm glad we started that out. Click. Click. Hello? Angus? Are you searching my child? Yeah? For Angus? You can search all you like for your Angus. Everyone has a different Angus. For some, Angus is a happy marriage. For some, a good career. For some, a fancy car. My Angus is a guy named Angus. Lives here. My child, no Angus will ever compare to the one true Angus, the Lord God above. Okay. Dear, have you encountered God this day? Look, my mom works at the church. I'm in the club by default. Click. Okay, the last one. Click. Hello? 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 I'm looking for Angus. Any idea where Angus lives? I believe he is at number two. Written on the button, I think. It looks, uh, broken. I think the little guy he lives with kicked it in. Greg? Or something. How? Beats me, kid. I just live here. Click. Click. Hello? Ah! Who is this? Hi, it's it's May. <laughs> May? Yeah, May. I just got electrocuted. Oh yeah, it's fiddly. There's no button. Yeah, you can like stick a screwdriver in it. Well, it's too late now. Uh, come on up. And then we come on up. And and then we come on up because we are meant to do that. <laughs> Hello, Angus. Woo, come right in. Hey, dude. Uh, welcome to our apartment. I could have been in my underwear. Hey dude, don't wear pants in my account. Why was the door unlocked? Greg always forgets to lock it. Greg is at work if you're looking for Greg. I was actually looking for you. My laptop is messed up and I thought, what's wrong with it? Lots of things pop up and I turn it on. What kinds of things? You know, things about things, not for kids things, or nothing, just things. I'm gonna say the first one, you know, things about things, not for kids things. <laughs> Why didn't you bring it with you? I forgot it. Mm-hmm. You know, May, you don't have to, like, have to be embarrassed about... I'm not. I mean, everyone I know. Hmm, let me see what I can do. Awkward sounds. Okay, I got something for you. Without my computer, <laughs> he's definitely a hacker, like Greg said. <laughs> Plug this into any USB port and restart. Should clear you right up. It might delete some of your old files, though. Wow, thanks, dude. No problem. I'm gonna head on home. See if your magic works. It's not magic. It's just ones and zeros. And we're just atoms. And our perception of reality is just chemical reactions. Take those away and poof, there goes the universe. Whoa. Sorry. I'm gonna go. Don't leave Angus like that. Angus. Later on, May's gonna say that Angus is psychic. <laughs> oh my god, this game is so fun. I, I, I don't know. I hope you guys are enjoying it. But if not, then I'm gonna be sad. <laughs> hey, Dadders. Why, if it isn't the mayor of Possum Springs herself, what did you get up to today? I'm not with Angus a bit. You remember him? Oh yeah, I like Angus. He's smart. In the old days, I used to work with his dad. I know they fell on some hard times after we all got laid off. Used to see him at the bar. Yeah. After I stopped drinking, I didn't really see him as much. I wonder how he is. Did they find out anything about that arm? Not that I heard. Oh, huh, well, be careful out there. Maybe I should carry mace or brass knuckles or something. This is where the stupid jokes pop up. Well, it would be a shame if you got into trouble and were unarmed. Now I think I'll be okay. What? <laughs> okay, I get it. Unarmed? Eh? I'm gonna go to bed now. Good night, Mayor Kitten. Good night.
get it, guys, because we were talking about a lost arm, and then he said he wouldn't want to see us unarmed. <laughs> Let's see if this Angus fix works. Can't get any worse, at least. I guess it could be on fire. Anyway. Or, you know, it could be a virus. Oh my god, it's fixed! I guess it turned out okay then, your computer? Yeah, it did, thanks. I put something else on that drive. Do you remember Demon Tower? Oh wow, yeah, I used to play that all the time like 10 years ago. I've been playing again. They've kept updating it. You can grab your old save game from their server and start right where you left off. Ooh, cool. You should check it out and we can talk Demon Tower sometime. It's really cool still. I'm definitely going to do this. Oh, uh, thanks, Angus. Tips hat. Hey, you get that, you know, off your laptop. <laughs> I heard you broke it with so much, you know. <laughs> Dude, you know what? <laughs> Rick Rackage told me that before the internet, they'd hide, you know what, in a hollow log in the woods. Yeah, that was a thing, right? Be awkward if you were hiking out to the thing, and some dude was already there, and you're like, Sup, dude. I guess we're both here for the, you know what? <laughs> I bet that happened, you know it did. I bet they became friends. Uh, you know what, long bros forever. <laughs> so dude, you coming to the party tomorrow now, you right? What party? Up in the state forest, lots of people home from school and stuff this weekend. Cool people, the big fire, the snacks, the beers. Did you mean to write snacks or snakes? Both, dude. Both. Cool, well, you should ask B if she can drive us. What? No, I don't think she likes me. Nah, dude, she's cool. She drives us all the time and lets us borrow her, oh, her car. Oh, I just choked. Stop by her store tomorrow and ask her. Okay, please. Okay, whatever. Yeah! <laughs> Oh my god, if if anyone wants to see some Demon Tower, I can make that a separate series or like a stream or something. Because I know Demon Tower is very difficult. And when I mean very difficult, it's like, think about, um, what's it called? Oh my god, how did I forget what it's called? Hollow Knight, there it is. Hollow Knight, but harder. Like, Cuphead level difficulty. Okay, uh, do we talk to B now, or is it tomorrow? No, okay, it's tomorrow. This is Casey Hartley, the the missing uh, friend of ours. And it's still just a missing less... A missing... What? <laughs> what am I saying? An away message. <laughs> Which says, Born to lose country trash, proud drummer, skate and destroy, skate to create, found for glory. And then charcoal. Okay, and so I'm going to go to bed, and I'm most like I think I have enough time for the party, because I, I'm not going to end it quickly. <laughs> if I enjoy a game, I'm going to be recording it as long as I want. <laughs> like games like Fears to Fathom, that game, it was actually scary, first of all. <laughs> But also, I recorded it until I beat it because I think they're actually pretty short. Some people are like, no, you're, you're, you're full of crap if you think the fourth Fierce to Fathom game is short. But I beat it in an hour and it's meant to take around two hours, so. Oh, by the way, B works at the old pickaxe, so you can go there. Get some tools, lol. Big axe and go on a rampage, lol. A charcoal. We have to click on charcoal every time before we uh, leave. Oh my god. Where the people know my name. And my mom's name. And my dad's name. And about the time I put that kid in the hospital. Yeah, okay, let's not talk about that. <laughs> That's a spoiler for, for later. Morning, mom. All day, mom. Every day. What are you up to today? Greg and Angus and B are going to a party. So I might go out with them. A party, huh? Look at you. Back two days and ready the social butterfly. 
I'm in pretty high demand. Uh, I'm a little nervous. Oh, you'll be fine, sweetie. Get out there and mingle. Actually, I think it's mostly going to be old high school people. I wonder if Cole will be there. I always thought you two were so cute together. Mom, no. Oh, sorry, honey. I didn't know that was still a sensitive subject. It's not. Okay, well, you go out there and have a nice time, honey. I will. See you later. Hey, honey. What? Eels, honey. Eels, Mom. Still talking about the eels. If you don't know what, what, what we're talking about, it's eels. You're gonna have to go watch the first episode. <laughs> You're gonna be surprised when you when the people that are just like joining into the night in the woods community, like they're gonna be so confused. At first, I was like, this game looks pretty fun because I watched uh, Yob's playthrough. Yob is a really cool YouTuber. I'm gonna link his channel in the description. And um, and I watched his playthrough and I was sick because I was scrolling through his channel and um, and I found this game, like the playlists of this game that he played. And so I decided it looks pretty cool. So I watched his videos and I eventually bought the game and I fell in love. It became my favorite game. So what are you up to do these days? Um, crashing here until I get back in my own place? Parents rented out half the place to Mr. Chazikov. I've been babysitting, interviewed at Hampath, waiting to hear back. Ooh, my dad works at Hampath now. They caught everything. Oh, come on, Selmers, why are you going to start telling us your strange but nice poems? And if we don't start selling business, there ain't gonna be a possum springs. So we gotta do whatever we can do. I said that weirdly. To get the market to notice us. Can we get back to the topic at hand? Yeah, so we allocate funds to preserve the statue of... Gary, you're not... He Gary, you're not hearing me. Sorry, that's not a female. Don't tell me I'm not hearing you, Andrew. It's not of sufficient historical note. Your butt is not of his sufficient historical note. Guys, guys, stop this. This is the stoplight fight all over again. Oh yeah, and remember who won that one? Can we move on? Fine. Fine. Those guys are gonna be appearing later on in the in the game. They're they're buttholes. I can legally shoot you for being up here, you know. Haha, <laughs> you'd never. I used to babysit your cat. Eh. <laughs> you got me there. Can't shoot a babysitter. That is. It was fine then, but now not anymore. Okay. So this guy will tell us, I think, when the when the power lines are back. What you doing up there? Streetlight got tore off in that big storm a few days back. Don't help that idiots keep jumping on it. That's a shame. Spread the word to the other kids. Adults. Oh, I don't think so. Adults got jobs and better things to do anyway. Ah. Anyway, you tell those other kids to lay off. Gonna get themselves or somebody else killed. You know when they're fixing the steps? I desperately need to get to church. Tomorrow, I think. And the vampires can't go on sacred ground. I ain't seen no vampires around here, except maybe the government, sucking us dry. You've taken over my vampire story. I'm leaving. Watch out for them bloodsuckers, kid. Adult! Yeah, it sucks being short. I'm just saying that. I'm not actually that short. I'm just saying that. Because <laughs> it is true. It sucks being short. <laughs> oh, he's not here today. I could check. Okay, she's not here. I'm actually not sure if she's ever been there. I'm trying to remember. I'm trying to use my brain. I know it's shocking. I've got one. But I'm trying to use my brain and remember if she's there. In my last playthrough. Hey, kids. Hey, adult. Well, I was your age only a few years ago. Uh-huh. 
Well, see you later. <laughs> That's it. Okay, I spent my precious time doing this. But that's how Night in the Woods kind of is. Sometimes it's like, oh yes, a very like sad or interesting thing, conversation, and then there's that. It's like, I don't know what to tell you. It's definitely like a game not meant to be taken too seriously, at least not at the beginning. Well, getting on the board's cold f comfort. I'm just always on edge. You maybe see someone to talk about this? Dr. Hank? Ugh, Dr. Hank does everything and nothing. He fixed my leg at least. What? He fixed my leg last year. He's treated my babies through chicken pox and strap. I know. I just. Whatever. Okay, those two always talk about, like, coffee and. Other stuff. I'm gonna check around uh, town first because I want to see if, like, maybe Germ is there. And Germ is another character. Actually, is Angus here? Because if he is, then I can talk to him. Yes. These are some of the most amazing conversations ever. Anyway, how's the laptop running? Really good. Thanks so much. Glad to be off service. So, like, yeah. Who rents movies anymore? How is this still or still open? There's a certain romance to VHS and DVD that simply cannot be matched. Really? Nope. Wait, you actually have VHS? Mostly the adult section back behind the curtain. Whoa, really? Yeah, some folks are like really into seeking them out. It's like a whole little scene that goes back before the internet. We had a historian in there last month looking for some obscure video. How do you get that job? I think that's the kind of job you can only have if you don't need to have a job. So this party tonight, huh? Yeah, should be fun. I hadn't, I hadn't pegged you. I see yep, as a. Oh my god, I hadn't pegged you as a party person. I'm not really, but parties with Greg are different. How so? You know how you want to just go and stand in a corner sometimes, yeah? Greg's my corner. Aww. Haha, <laughs> shut up. See you later. For sure. So, that was actually one of the longest conversations with Angus, and it may not seem too long. Oh, hello. Actually, oh yeah, I remember this guy. Never mind. Hey there. Uh, hey. Who are you? Wags. Okay, hello. What are you. Oh, wait, there's a sign. Navy, huh? Yes, ma'am. You ever considered a future in the Navy? Like, boats? It's a lot more than that, but yes, there are boats. I'm uh, probably not joining the Navy, or... Can I drive a submarine? Potentially. <laughs> eh, I can do that on my own. I doubt it. <laughs> Later. You know, I don't want to intrude. But if you're someone who's maybe lacking a bit of direction... That's what brings a lot of folks to the Navy. Yeah, but I have lots of direction. Like, I'm gonna hang out with my friends. Play base, play video games, go to sleep. Etc. <laughs> I guess I'm adding drive a submarine to the list somewhere. <laughs> well, just saying. I'm gonna go now. All right now. Have a go. Are you, like, from around here? Nearby. Used to be anyway. Is this like a thing they make you do? Like, why aren't you on a battleship or something? Every job's important. This is just my job right now. Have you been places? Well, I've been all over the world. See any sharks? I've seen sharks, yes. Big ones? Pretty big. Pretty big. When you're doing your pitch, you should lead with the sharks. <laughs> Noted. Or... Like, instead of the Navy doing Navy stuff, you make the entire thing about sharks. Shark diving. Shark watching. Shark riding. Are you writing this down? I'll send it up the chain. <laughs> Man, I don't think he's gonna do that. <laughs> I don't think kind of legal. You're making them 
say things about the Navy that's not true. <laughs> smelter, smelter is coming for you. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? That was very important to see. I think this is the last day where I have to do something and I can't just run around everywhere else. Yeah. Uh, not hiking out of the edge of town today. Got stuff to do. Yeah, okay. So, every other day I can just go there. And most of the time it's just germ there. But, uh, occasionally there's germ with homeless people. <laughs> party, party, party! Jeez, dude, you are excited about this party. You're gonna be there! That's awesome! God, what a great week it's been. You're home! I'm home! The little dance Greg does is. He does that a lot, by the way. My arms are tired. That is literally. <laughs> I've been already recording for 38 minutes. It's not feel like that when you're playing a good game. I've already been in the video art post too. I was about to go in there again. Okay, at the old pickaxe. Where is B? I need to talk to you. Yeah, Bill, write it up as on the clock. She's not gonna like that. I don't care if she doesn't like it. It was her fault, plain and simple. That is time extra. We charge for that. Alright then. What was that all about? Uh, don't even ask. Mrs. Miranda has locked one of our guys in her basement twice. Why? Because she's old and she's forgetful. Maybe if she gets a bill for it, she'll remember next time. Huh. What do you want? Well, Greg asked me to ask you if you would drive us to the party tonight. You know, the one up in the state park. Thanks for clarifying, otherwise I might have been confused as to which of the dozens of parties going down on any given night in Possum Springs you were referring to. Are you being sarcastic? I'll drive. Great, thanks. We'll be by your house at 8.30. Be ready or we'll go without you. Okay. Don't get lost on your way home. I know where I live. No, seriously. Go home and get ready. Alright, alright, jeez. B. Beatrice Santello. Actually, do we ever find out Greg's name? Because I remember, I know B, B's name is, full name is Beatrice Santello. It's literally written down there. But I don't think we actually get, like, her, or no, we do get her full name. We don't get Greg's full name. So we go home, and then, why can't we go up this tree? Anyway, we go home, we get ready, and then, that's basically it, we have to go to the party. After talking about tacos with our parents. What a shame. Yeah, you can just jump on, oh. Hey, man. What? I was just stopping by to see how you were doing. Why? After that other night, I mean. Why shouldn't I be fine? May a lot of things that happen around here. Sometimes in town, sometimes out by the tracks. Sometimes up in the hills. What? It's my job to make sure folks like you never see something like what you saw the other night. You're not doing a very good job of it, or... Folks like you, you're a kid, man, and you're naive, and in its own stupid way, that's beautiful. But the world isn't, and the world isn't out there somewhere, it's here. Alright, are you gonna arrest me or something? Because I have a party to go to. Watch yourself, man. I'd really hate to see something happen to you. And being in the wrong place at the wrong time is all it takes. That's all I'm saying. That's ominous. Good night, May. If you couldn't tell, we don't like Aunt Molly. 
thought Aunt Mulcop is planning to kill me. What is a cab? I don't know. Someone tell me what a cab means. Okay, uh, we go talk about tacos. Hey, sweetie. Look who's home. Hey, the parents. I make tacos. Excuse me, we make tacos. Tacos? Tacos. Do you want tacos? I want tacos every day, all day. No, I'm going to stack it up at the party later. I want tacos every day, all day. The family that tacos together, rockos together. Honey, no. What? I'm so angry right now. You've all turned against me. May, honey, do you want sour cream on, on your taco? I want everything. I want it all. Give them all to me. Okay, okay, okay. It's go time. Oh, I should probably make sure I don't look like a cave beast. Let's talk to, you know, to our friends on the computer. OMG, party time. Are you ready, B? I'm ready. Are you ready? Oh, well, maybe I should get ready. Yeah, maybe. Hey, don't forget about the party tonight. I haven't. Then what are you doing under your laptop? Get ready. Jeez, okay. Yeah. And this is where we talk to ourselves. Looking alright. God, this shirt really accentuates my roundness. I have the worst face. I have a nightmare face. She's really self-conscious, by the way, if you couldn't tell. Jeez, what a mess. My big dumb eyes, my nightmare eyes. The other one is my messed up ear. But I think I prefer nightmare eyes. Just random. Nightmare eyes would be an excellent horror movie. You'll see the nightmare eyes outside your window, and you'll know. You can do this. People like you. People don't like you, clearly. Or, you don't like people, clearly. People don't like you, clearly. No friends at college. Not even one. Not really their fault. Something's... Whatever. Who cares if Cole is there? Jerk. He's probably up at school or whatever, or prom was mistaken in like 10 different ways. Yeah, <laughs> that dress, that picture under the doorway, flower thing. Less slow dancing than slow standing. Careful non-touching, no smooches. I'm so glad I'm not a teenager anymore. My breath tastes like tacos. This is a disaster. All right, what are you gonna say? You're a smooth talker, you're a smooth. Hey, I'm May. How's it going? Oh, hey, I'm May. What's your name? Hi, I'm May. I dropped at college earlier this week. And now I'm in the woods. Drinking. Jeez, uh, this is yet another road to the hermitdom. This is hopeless. Wheel me out to the curb for gar garbage day. I cannot read. Oh, jeez, they'll be here any minute. Good luck, kid. I don't need luck. I make my own luck with a luck machine. The party. We're in a car. Hey, man. I think Cole might be there tonight. Yeah, I know. Geez, sorry. I don't care if he's there. He might not be. Well, let's hope so or not. I don't even know what you're we're talking about. Man, Cole went out and drew you. Yeah, and I didn't work out. If you if you actually don't talk to your mama about Cole, and then she would be like shocked that Greg said, Oh, okay, Cole might be here. She'd be like, What? What is Cole gonna be doing here? But since we talked with our mother that Cole might be there, we're actually just annoyed now that Greg is pulling it up. So let's stop talking about it. Let's. See, B is not a bad person. She's just like. serious. Ugh. That was awful. I hate beer. I can't remember the last time I drank beer. It's not a delicious drink at all. I don't know if I should have another drink right now. Let's annoy B for a second. What? Nothing. Cool party. Yep. Who are you talking to? Not you. 
And then we can't talk to her anymore. Oh god, it's... Yeah, that's cool. Here you can just sit down. We're gonna have to. And here's a Greg Angus. Hey dudes. Yo, did you see Cole's here? Oh god. You okay? Yeah, totally fine. You gonna talk to him? Yeah, sure. Yeah, man. You sure, man? Yeah, I mean, why should I be weird about it? I, I, I'm I, sorry, I can't read today. <laughs> well, I mean, he did write that song afterwards. What was it called? Go Get Dead Angel Face? Ugh, we don't talk about Go Get Dead Angel Face. Can you guys believe this dude playing guitar? Yep, playing the douchebag hits. I like this song. Is this a douchebag song? Nah, don't worry, big guy. There's a douchebag like this at every party. You have no idea, Greg. Back in school, you'd always have some frat boy hanging out on the lawn, trying to look all sensitive. Why is this a douchebag song? He's never gonna give it up. <laughs> oh god, it's... Maybe I need another drink. And then she gets drunk after him. <laughs> Believe it or not. If you dodge doing something with a drink, then, you know, it'll never work out. <sighs> Guess beer is just one of those horrible things adults do, like doing taxes and having babies. Hey, May, is that you? Wow, how are you? Well, earlier this week I dropped out of school, and now I'm drinking in the woods. Wow, okay. What, it, what the hell is your problem? What? Be cool, man. Go get a drink and be cool. Okay, so at this point we get sloppy drunk. And, um, we start talking nonsense. Screw it, I'm doing two beers. I'm doing beer. I still taste tacos. Okay? What? Nothing. Like, she breaks character, the drunk characteristic. I don't know if I can do this. Okay, let's talk to Greg and Angus. Hey, Greg. Whoa, dude, are you okay? Hey, Greg, did you know I think you and Angie... Angie? Are so cute. I did know that, dude. Well, good. Hey, Angie, my dad knows your dad. They used to work together back in the 80s. Okay. He used to hang out at the bar with your daddy. Dude, don't ever say daddy again. Psst. What? My dad had to stop drinking because he's a danger to me and my mom. <laughs> Dude. Okay, man, you're not allowed to drink anymore. Ever. Okay, I'm a little worried about you, man. But well, I'm having a great time here in the woods, okay? Greg, don't you think maybe May should sit down? Yeah, dude, you should sit. Dude, sit down by the fire and chill, okay? By the way, it offends me that they say that there's a douchebag at every <laughs> every party. Because I, I pl practice guitar. I'm not great at it yet. Trying to get better. <laughs> okay, and then, yo. Hey, man. Hey, Coolio. Whoa, I haven't heard that in forever. It's been like three years. That's not a long at all. Well, it was good to see you. I'm just back for a couple of days from school and. Shut up already. What? You never even cares. Didn't we? No, not successfully. I'm sorry. I don't even care. The girl at the video stores are like, ooh, cute boys, and you're a cute boy, girl. Oh, thanks, man. I, but I hate gay people. Cute as the rest. Okay, well, I'm gonna go. And it's not my fault I'm an old trash fire. I got nightmare eyes. And the last thing you see is my eyes outside your window. 
and then I stab you with my knife. Stab, stab, stab. Boom. Dead. And the police get there, you're all nightmares. New nickname. So you're on F with me, kid. Okay, man, you're threatening people now. May, I think you need to. F college. Yeah. All those rich kids and nah, hot people are writing checks and having paper in each other. Close enough. And that damn statue pointing at me every day. Supposed to be the founder, but just shapes. I, I'm a total trash mama. And nothing is ever going to work out. I never had a chance here. But I can't go anywhere else. I'm home again. And I can do something besides sleep and cry out. <laughs> because things aren't just things here, you know? Oh god, I'm so sick to death. Does that make sense, Kaya? May, I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to upset you. I think you're really great. Home again! Woo! <laughs> Tacos. <laughs> Okay, and then we drive home with B, I think. Yep. If you puke in this car, so help me. I owe you an apology, or I really am quite embarrassed. I'll say I owe you an apology, B. I'm sorry, I don't even know what happened. You got sloppy but drunk after what? Three cups of watered down beer? Uh, remember when we used to be friends? We used to be best friends in the bee, and I said we be. I didn't get a word of that. Remember, you used to call me Mayne, and I called you BB. Oh, you mean when we were like 10? No, I don't. Remember, we were scouts together, and we caught that turtle? Yeah, Box of the Turtle. He died. Are you so mean to me, or I feel like you're mad at me all the time? Why? Why are you so mad at me all the time? Oop. Oh man, if I be again, you hear your parents, you're gonna be so mad at me. Tell your mom I'm sorry, okay? She's so nice. God dang it, man. What? My mother is dead. What? She died of cancer senior year. Oh no, it's just so nice. Baby, are you okay? How did you not know this? Did you forget about my dead mom? This was a terrible lapse of memory, B. I'm so sorry, or I'm mortified by my behavior. I'm sorry. Oh, B, I'm acting like a jerk. Are you mad at me? What happened to you? You used to be smart. You used to be cool. You used to be worth talking to. Why did you even come back? Oh, did college not work out for you? Was it inconvenient? Were you not in the mood? <laughs> I would have killed for that. I still would. I'd kick you out of this moving car right now if it meant I could go to college. <laughs> We're here. Get the hell out of my car. <laughs> oh god, let me help you in. There you go. I'm sorry to be on a mess. You know, whatever. It's not your fault. You're just a kid. I'm older than you two months. Yeah, well, I stayed here and got older while well, you went off and stayed the same. <sighs> Good night, Mayday. She called us by her nickname. How sweet. <laughs> and then, Dream. <laughs> this may come out you know, random to other people, but May has these dreams. Also, the soundtrack is slapping in this game. If you ever just like doing something like drawing or painting or whatever, listen to the Night in the Woods soundtrack. It's actually really good. Smash things. Yeah. 
smash it, smash, 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 smash. Smash, 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 destroy, destroy everything. Okay, I don't think we can break that part. Break this window, yeah, yeah, destroy, chaos, anarchy, yeah, chaos, anarchy. You can destroy everything here but I I'm not gonna do that I can let you guys do that because this is fun it's chaos and anarchy that's a joke don't go attacking things and breaking things with a baseball bat don't do that even if you think it's fun <laughs> and here is like I think I don't know why, but I think the reason we've got a baseball bat and not like, I don't know, like a hammer or something else is because we beat that one kid with a baseball bat. And I think that's why we have a baseball bat. And also, this is the statue of the founder in college May was talking about earlier. So if, if anyone, and a lot of people don't know that actually. You just gotta destroy it like a Dark Souls boss. Do I have to destroy the back leg or the front leg first? I don't remember. Okay, the back leg first. Ouch. We destroy. Later on in the game, we're gonna have Stranger Dreams, um, because Stranger Things are gonna happen. And yes, by the way, this is clarification, this is a dream. This isn't, like, story-wise in the game. <laughs> but the dreams are gonna, you know, are like, kinda boring most of the time. They do have... Nice tunes though. Part two. Weird Autumn. And this is where I've got to end. Um, if you did enjoy though, this you what the fuck am I saying? <laughs> if you did enjoy though, please do leave a like and subscribe. I will try and remember to put Yub's channel in the description. I know probably most of you already know Yo, but if you don't, I'll put him down in the description. He's a really good YouTuber. Uh, I do recommend him. I'm also going to put down my friend's uh, YouTube channel in the description below. Um, I also have to thank him a lot for the, for the birthday wishes. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye!